Okay, Torsten, uh, big pin, 10 seconds into the third period. Uh, guy chose bottom. You were, first off, you're getting ridden like a dog the whole second yeah. period, right? Would you agree? Yeah, I was, yeah. Uh, what do you take from something like that when you got a freshman on top of you? He's riding you hard and uh, rides you out the whole period. Well, I mean, I've wrestled him before, and uh, I, yeah, I, I knew I could have gotten out if I tried a little harder. I just I was pretty tired. It's my first match back. You know, I've been practicing obviously for the past month or so now, or two weeks, because uh, I was out for my concussion. But, uh, I, I mean, I was a little tired. We had a little scramble at the end the first period, so uh, coming into the second period I was a little tired, but third period I knew, you know, I figured he's down, I can ride him at least, and I know I can turn him, so. You pulled him right into the crab and yeah. got your hips on top, and then what happened? And then uh, I hopped over and I just had it so tight, and I didn't feel him fighting really, and I was just kind of expecting to get some back points out of it, but when I felt him kind of not really fighting, I kind of went for the kill. So. All right. When you between now and uh, the EWL tournament, we got about four, about four weeks out yeah, right now. now. What's the mentality? You know, you're just coming back. You're just getting your legs and your wind back underneath you. You know, how hard do you, you need to train between now and the EWLs? Uh, I really, I've been harping on getting my wind back. I mean, uh, Flynn put me through the other morning when we had a day off, and uh, he wants me to come in basically every morning when we have a day off and just condition, putting me through like seven, eight minute things, a couple sets of them, just. Uh, Letting me, I mean, because I know I have the condition, but he wants to show me that I, it's okay to get tired. You know, you're going to feel like this. you got to be able to get used to it, you know. Okay, you guys got some big duels coming up. You're going to have UNC coming into town. Yeah, that'll be good. And then you guys got to actually go down. And it should be for the EWL title, the mm -hmm. dual title at least, Pitt. with Pitt. Uh, what are you anticipating? You're going to have, I believe, Albright. What are you anticipating for Pitt? Uh, just wrestle. I mean, I didn't. I, I haven't really met, uh, met up with him at all this year. I haven't been in any tournaments with him. So, I mean, I'm not sure. I'll watch some tape, see what happens. And I think we should do all right. We should win. Oh, you guys think you're pretty confident? Yep, I'm confident. I think we got one of the top teams in the nation. I mean, we just have had so many injuries. And once everyone's back, I mean, Fluke's back in the lineup. Once King's back, we got uh, when Phil comes back, Morcone. And then, uh, I mean, We've just had some big heavy hitters out for a while now, and I think we're getting them back. So. Do you think it's going to have to be all hands on deck, every starter hitting on all cylinders to beat Pitt? Wouldn't hurt, you know. It uh, certainly wouldn't hurt, but, I mean, we proved tonight we can do pretty good things with some backups in, so I think we'd like to have all starters. Right, Torsten, you got anything else for me? Uh, nope, that's pretty much it. All right, hey, thanks for the time. Nice pin tonight, and uh, good luck. I'll be with you guys uh, going on to pit, hopefully. All right, thanks.